Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how to find Google Earth files and how to import them into the new version of Google Earth. Let's go ahead and take a look at how to do this. So first of all, I have Google Earth open here in my web browser, but I'm going to go and do a Google search now for a Google Earth file that I might want to display. Perhaps I want to find something about the Roman Empire. Okay. Maybe I'm teaching world history and I want to find something about the Roman Empire and I want to display it in Google Earth. Well, a generic search for Roman Empire is going to give me 440 million results. But if I go over here to our settings and jump into the advanced search, I'm going to go down to file type and the file type I'm looking for is Google Earth KML. And now we'll do our search, only 214 results. And we can see this one here from marionschools.net. And now we have that Google Earth file downloaded to my computer. Now that we have that file downloaded, let's go back into Google Earth. And we'll go to File. We want to import KML KMZ file. And now I have that on my desktop. Let's go ahead and insert it. And there it is. There's that file now downloaded and displayed in Google Earth. And you can see here, it's now under my local KML files. And if I go here to more options, you can see here that I can rename it. I can export it again as a KML file. And you can see here I can add to it. And I can add a tile overlay or add folder if I like as well. Now I can go ahead here and zoom in on this. If I go into slideshow mode, we can now see it full screen without any of the uh, file menus up at the top. And we can zoom through and click on any of the aspects of this file including this little dialog box it tells me a little bit more about what we are seeing so that's how you can import kml files or google earth files into the new version of google earth for your web browser as always for more things like this please subscribe to my youtube channel